Welcome back. Today in the sweatshop, we are talking belts and pulleys. So what does a belt do? It drives your accessories. So your alternator, your power steering pump, uh, your AC compressor, water pump, those types of things. If you don't change them periodically, what you can expect is something like this. Believe it or not, this belt here is the same belt as these two. But the person didn't know what signs to look for. Part of those signs was this thing making this noise. When you hear that noise, especially in the morning generally, or on a cold start, you'll hear it much louder. And it's a good indicator as to what's coming. Don't wait for this to happen to you. Luckily for this customer, this was an AC tensioner. So the only thing that happened was, it happened actually on a hot day. So he was left <laughs> extremely hot, sweaty, and smelly. So don't let this happen to you. If it's an alternator or a water pump, you can do some damage with the water pump and then with the alternator you'll most likely get stranded on the side of the road in terms of belts the signs to look for are right here that cracking is a good indicator that you're going to have a bad day very soon you don't want to wait to this point if you see that I always suggest just to replace it you can wait and then you'll end up calling me again later saying hey uh can you come and tow me? But, you know, choices up to the individual. That's a good sign to replace it. This here is what a new belt looks like. There's no cracks, no damage. It hasn't been wrecked by dragging around a pulley that uh, has way too much stiffness. This here is a good example of that. It's a quiet pulley. It looks good, other than the rust and cosmetically, but it's way too stiff, like someone threw a blue pill at it. That's not a good thing. This thing's a piece of junk. So, what does a good pulley look and sound like? Something like this. You can see it spins freely. There's no noise from it when I spin it and it doesn't have any sort of play. It's as simple as that. So those are the signs you can look for to save yourself a terrible day. Hopefully this helps you. If it does, please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks, we'll see you in the next one.